Hello everyone. Welcome to another episode of To the Point. Today's topic of discussion is tree seed shortage. First of all, let's see why it is in the news. The United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, has recently highlighted a critical issue in global environmental conservation, a shortage of high-quality tree seeds. This issue has been documented in the second report on the state of the world's forest genetic resources, released during the 20th meeting of the Commission on Genetic Resources for Food and Agriculture in Rome. Now let's discuss about global seed shortage. According to the FAO, while 70% of countries have tree seed programs in place, the systems are often insufficient to meet the demand for high-quality seeds required for restoration and conservation efforts. These programs typically focus on the collection, production, storage and distribution of seeds essential for global reforestation. However, the FAO report highlights that many countries still struggle to meet their reforestation targets due to a severe lack of high-quality seeds. Now let's talk about challenges in seed quality and availability. Despite having about 83,000 seed stands covering 7 million hectares and 5,800 seed orchards across 39,000 hectares, many countries still depend on unreliable sources for their seeds. The quality of seeds is a major concern. Many available seeds are not resilient enough to withstand climate change, pests and diseases which further hampers the efforts to restore and protect global forests. Furthermore, most countries lack proper systems to test and trade seeds internationally, making it difficult to access good quality seeds. Now let's discuss about impact of climate change on seed production. The impact of climate change exacerbates the seed shortage problem. Rising temperatures and unpredictable rainfall patterns are severely affecting tree growth. This stress leads to lower seed production, as stressed trees are less likely to produce seeds. Although some countries believe that warmer temperatures may benefit seed maturation, most have not conducted adequate research to understand this effect fully. Changing flowering patterns have also added to the complexity of seed collection, with many nations struggling to replace old seed orchards. Another significant issue is the slow pace of tree breeding programs, which are crucial for improving seed quality. Now lastly, moving on to need for stronger investment and technological innovation. To address these challenges, the FAO stresses the need for urgent action. There is an immediate need for increased funding to support research, better seed storage and the training of new experts in tree seed conservation. Countries must invest in improving seed orchards and adopt digital tools and genetic research to find the best seeds suited for various climates and conditions. The FAO also calls for leveraging indigenous knowledge to support seed conservation. Now is the time for practice question. Consider the following statements about state of the world's forest genetic resources. 1. The second report on the state of the world's forest genetic resources was released by the United Nations Environment Programme. 2. The report emphasizes the importance of tree seed programs in global reforestation efforts. Which of the statements given above is or are correct? A. 1 only B. 2 only C. Both 1 and 2 D. Neither 1 nor 2 Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.